Welcome to another edition of Toy Nuts. This is a little toy haul. I did a uh, trade with a guy on Facebook, Sean Keen, for the girl from Power Lords. Her head broke. It's my fault I dropped it, but it's not supposed to turn anyhow, so I'll just glue it back on. She's missing her uh, bra and her cape. But I will be working on getting that. Thanks again, Sean Keen, man. That was cool of you. Uh, I found these at a thrift shop. They are from Men in Black. I think they're from Burger King. There was something inside of them. Because you can open them up. But Love Aliens. Thought those were cool, so I picked those up. I remember these from when I was a kid in the 80s and I love hillbilly bears the fur skins this is gonna go in my collection he's even got his little boots and everything I think these came from Wendy's but anyhow I uh, thought that was cool another thing I found I went into a flea market and I found anybody that's been watching my videos for a long time knows I love uh, branded uh, vinyl toys and I found sprout from green giant vegetables he's got a little sash that says pasta accents ooh I thought that was pretty cool got him for a couple bucks I also found a Kia mole from droids I've got her up for sale right now on eBay or I would have brought her down I found a little uh, Dragon Ball Z dude from Burger King. Not big into those, but I'll make a thing out of those to uh, sell online. Now, went to Toys R Us. Not big on much new toy lines. I do like some of them. But anybody that knows Toys R Us put out their own toy lines this year. I wish they would have been a little more successful because I really liked them. But apparently they're going out. I picked these up for $1.88 a piece. They're the Monster 500 cars. I'm going to go ahead and pull them out of the package. Oh, I didn't know they come with the card. And these are pretty nice die cast cars. I'm almost betting Hot Wheels made these for them. But anyhow, here's Drac Attack, the Dracula. And these remind me of, uh, like, uh, Big Daddy Roth style Rat Fink cars. Uh, I already reviewed the big one of this, which is uh, Lead Foot, the Big Foot. But the car, the little one looks a little different. The actual big one looks like a log. This one still does too, but it's gray. But here's Leadfoot. Gotta love that. I mean, look at that smile, man. That's friggin' awesome. Love Big Daddy Raw styled stuff. And I know there's some of my fellow collectors out there that do too. I just think these were cool. It's sad that the line's gonna die but at least I was able to get a few and this one I loved it when I seen what it was called it is called Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Ride tell me that isn't cool and it's the old 60s style car with the top made on it like the monster mobile and stuff i mean big daddy roth all over it it's just freaking awesome and the doctor or mr ride's got a zombie hand in his hand those things are awesome but anyhow guys two videos i'm putting out this week you'll see my uh trade with t-biz and this little haul video hopefully soon I will be able to get my video of my toy room together so you guys can see that uh, 
check out my fellow YouTubers, Dr. Twisted's Realm, uh, Alan Eight Wolf. Hopefully, he puts out some more videos soon. Uh, Optimus B, my boy T Biz out in Texas. Uh, Count Stankus, check him out, dude. Awesome, has an awesome collection. Toy Room of Insanity, check him out. Uh, Hobby Man, Sean Henry, and my boy out in Cali, Ivan Ruiz. So until next time, never know what you're going to find, where you're going to find it. Happy collecting.